Hello, my name is Joanna and I'm here with my sister Janessa. The date is October 29th, 2020, and we are recording this interview in Chicago, Illinois. We are recording this interview during the COVID-19 pandemic. Uh, the first question I would like to ask you is, how has the pandemic affect your schoolwork? My schoolwork got better. Um, I have better grades now than before. Before March? Before March. Um, um, okay. What did you think when they said that we were doing school at home? So basically, what did you think about e-learning and how long it's been? I didn't believe it. I didn't watch the news or anything like that. I just um, didn't think it would last till the next year. That was going to be like the end of the school year. That's it. Oh, you didn't think it was going to be this long? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. How has your sleep schedule been like the last few months? So basic, wait, basically from when you started school till now, cause summer was fine. I it's an, it's it's got better. Uh, I go to sleep now like early, like at nine or ten. Wake up six forty. You wake up at six forty. Yes. Uh, what time do your classes start? Like classes, classes, not like the attendance thing. Um, eight. <clears throat> Oh, okay. And you don't feel tired in the morning? Morning? No. Oh, okay. Um, what has been the toughest part of staying at home? Not being able to do, like, go places with my family. And uh, define places, like where? What type of like, activities? I don't know, we would go to restaurants or, like, um round one which is a at arcade oh yeah okay you miss going around one mm -hmm. oh, okay um how did you feel when you found out that you were having a baby sister which was 2012 not now but you know i don't think i even like realized it at the time i don't think i i was oh you don't remember yeah, I don't remember. I, oh, do you remember when you found out you were having a baby sister? Maybe you remember yes, that. Yes, I remember that. You were crying. <laughs> uh, I really didn't believe it because I didn't know exactly everything about, you know, you were, baby. I think you were five? You were five. I was, I was five. Okay, since you don't remember that, how old, how old did you feel when you first saw your little sister? Oh, um... First time I saw her, like when we went to the hospital, or no, when we did the FaceTime, how how did that, how did you? I don't know. Yeah. I just felt your like happiness, and I was happy. I still didn't understand what was going on. I just knew I had a baby sister, but I didn't know what that meant. You know, I was I was I was, in trying to figure out what what, what is the difference about having a baby sister. Oh. Until she came home, and I realized, oh, she stayed with us. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Okay. Do you enjoy being the middle child? Mm, yeah, most of the time. Sometimes I um, I do get a little frustrated because I'm the middle child, so I have to... Frustrated with what? I get frustrated, like, with how I have to, like, no, I get it, but it's like, I have to take care of Jocelyn, my baby sister, and I have to be responsible with her and my sister, my older sister, be responsible with me. Like, take care of her? Yes. Okay. What did you, what do you say was the best part about being on the straight A honor roll the first time? Oh, uh, the first time? I was very emotional. Okay. <laughs> I think I was just so happy that I finally made my mother proud and there was something of me that I felt like oh this is where my life is gonna go after this like I have my whole life planned out and everything okay and when when did you get your first honor roll um in fourth grade <clears throat> um the last quarter oh, okay okay and you're in six I'm in seven you're seventh sorry <laughs> Okay, how do you feel about your school school life or education, like your grades, basically? I I think I'm very proud of it. I think I'm gonna get like better. I have 
my work and like how I want to succeed in life planned out. And your what's it called? Your constitution test and your what is it called? NDB NWEA is coming up. How do you feel about that? Because that's a part of school life. Like my just like a little voice inside of me telling me, you know, like you should get a little worried, just start, you know, you know, you don't know if you're gonna pass or not, like this determines all this. And then I tell myself, like, you know, you're fine, just study. It's gonna be fine. Like you have great memory. Yeah. So it's gonna it's gonna be okay. 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 And what is the best thing that has happened to you because of this pandemic? I could spend more time with my family. Um, I have I have to feel more responsible now, but I think I'm okay with that. And I I um, feel I love my family, so I love them being close to me. Mm-hmm. And they're very important to me. So I, I feel like that's one thing that we're all together in this and we're all going to stay together. Okay. So it brought you closer and you spend more time with them? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for being here with me. Um, have a good day.